hole. Mom, go away. Right. I definitely don't want to be one of those kids that are like 40 years old, they still live with their parents, and I feel like being 24, like, I'm almost at that point where I'm gonna be one of those people. So we need to cut the umbilical cord, and I need to go and live on my own. Morning. Morning. Um, I kind of want to get my own place with Jenny. Really? Yeah. Really? Like, no offense, but I'm 24 and I'm still living here. All my friends are moved out in their own apartments, and, you know, I kind of want to be on my own with Jenny. And where would you find a place to live? Jersey. Of course. Well, somewhere in Jersey, obviously. Somewhere in Jersey? Who's going to do all the shopping and the laundry? That's not your you're style. Like, you're like a buzzkill to this news right now. It's not your forte. OK, well, I went grocery shopping before. Yeah? That's fun. You're going to split the food bill down the middle? I don't know. Look you going to buy your own? It's, it's kosher the, the right word for Jenny. I do know that that's the food that the Jewish people eat. <laughs> No, Jenny. Jenny's, Jenny's not, not Jewish. Jewish. <laughs> Whoops. Whoops. See, I think kosher food is like organic, healthy food. But Jewish people eat organic food, too. So I feel like it's all in the same. So you told Jenny everything before you decide to move in? and I don't really tell Jenny yet. Um, but I'll tell her when I see her. She'll be OK. And you'll talk it out Jenny, before you make yeah. a commitment? She's my best friend. And you know, she gets it. I'm nervous about telling Jenny my secret just because I'm scared that she's gonna call off me and her living together. And I'm just gonna be like, no, bitch, let's just fucking do this because I need it. Thanks, Mom, for the advice. And